No, there doesn't appear to be any real rain coming our way at all. We are going into a dry pattern time period anyway, but um, things aren't really going to change, it looks like, uh, throughout this uh, season here. And with that, we do have a fire weather watch for Solano County because conditions will be getting dry. That's going to kick in Sunday morning and linger into early next week. Uh, that's Solano County, but still, it's a bit of a, a, a brief offshore wind. Doesn't help much, but we do have a little bit of the way of fog still hanging around portions of the bay. We expect that to mix out for at least the base perspective, but along the coast, it's going to remain kind of with that drizzle that we expect. Temperature check for right now, we're in the 50s over a good piece of real estate, 62 Antioch. Chilly to scratch right around 50s, you can see at the coast, and don't expect the mercury to move much more than that this afternoon. First things first, onshore we have for today, that'll be aided a little bit by inland heating going on. Then, very early tomorrow, a little shift happens here in Solano County, offshore winds. Now, they're interrupted by later onshore winds tomorrow afternoon. They're going to be the most acute, as you can see, around the peninsula, San Francisco, and up to the North Bay a little bit as well. Running through the longer range forecast models, there's a little hint as we get to around Thursday, maybe, of some showers trying to sneak in here. For right now, we're going to call this a little bit of a breezy wind event for now. We don't think that's really going to hit us. We'll see a successive models if things get any better, uh, but it's a little bit of a tease from that vantage point. The big issue will be probably we'll get some winds out of that system. Four zone forecast, checking in for your Saturday today, 60 for San Francisco. This is a modest effort, not so much just at the coast, but elsewhere compared to what the next 48 hours will look like. 59, Daly City Pacific, about 56. We have the lower 60s lining up along uh, the uh, Bay shoreline here on the peninsula. 66 for Foster City, Palo Alto, 68, 67 for Mountain View, heading down to Santa Clara Valley here. We got Santa Clara at 71, 70 for San Jose and Cupertino, Milpitas at about 69. Mid to upper 60s line up the East Bay shoreline. We've got a couple 70s here and there. 71 to check in for Livermore. 69 Pleasanton. 75 Walnut Creek. 77 for Concord. 67 for Berkeley. Notice Contra Costa County a little warmer there in a Solano County. Popping into the 80s, as you can see, Vacaville at 84, 82 for Fairfield. So this warm weather in uh, Sacramento Valley hasn't yet ventured into the Bay Area yet. It's coming. 74 for Napa, a chilly 65 Vallejo, 76 Sonoma, 74 Santa Rosa, and lower 70s as we head down south. So this is what we're talking about. Going on for today, we take care of the clouds, the windy conditions, 76, 84 tomorrow, 90 or so expected in some inland areas by Monday, then uh, slipping a little bit. There's that Wednesday event of, we'll call it wind now. We'll see if that uh, develops to something better. Bay temperatures also fall into the 60s. As you can see, we'll do the same at the coast. Noel. Thanks, Dave.